Hey guys, welcome back to Kali J's Kitchen. In today's video, I'll take you guys in the kitchen with me and we are going to make some banana fritters with coconut. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Make sure you turn on your post notification bell so you can always be notified whenever I upload a new video. Go ahead and tell your friends, tell your family members about Kali J's Kitchen and have them subscribe to my channel. Follow me on Facebook, it's Kali J's Kitchen and follow me on Instagram, it's Kali Kitchen underscore one. So in a large bowl, I'm going to go ahead and add my bananas and I'm going to use about five medium size ripe bananas and then I'm going to use a fork to just crush my bananas until they're finely crushed so you just want to take your time and you can use the other hand to just spin your bowl in the meantime and just crush and always try to use overripe bananas that is a little bit easier to handle all right So because these bananas are really ripe, I'm not going to add any sugar, alright? So now that my bananas, they're nicely crushed, I'm going to go in and add my coconut milk powder, alright? I'm going to combine both the coconut milk powder and my crush bananas together until they're nicely combined and basically there you have it my bananas and my coconut milk powder they're nice they combine so now I'm gonna go in and add my flour and I'm using counter flour and I will also go in and add a small amount of salt and combine all of this together and then I'm gonna go in and add the water and you don't want your butter to be too runny or too thick all right so you have to be a little bit um conscious of what you're doing so while i'm doing this i have my frying pan on the stove with some olive oil that i'm going to use to fry my banana coconut fritters all right So this is the butter looking all lovely so now it's time to go in and I'm gonna drop my butter so I'm gonna use a tablespoon to drop it because I think with the banana fritters when you use a um, tablespoon it give it a nice small not too big and outrageous you want some small nice bite size fritters all right so I'm gonna go in and drop them and again, we want our fritters to be golden brown on both sides. So this fritters took me about seven minutes to prepare. All right, guys, so I'm going to flip them over on the other side because I want the other side to fry also and we want it to be golden brown. All right, so we're just going to flip, take our time to just flip them over and allow them to fry. So remember now you can always go ahead and have your banana coconut fritters by itself or you can just go in 
and have it with some cook up salt fish or you can just have it with some steamed vegetable all right so this is what my fritters look like so i'm just gonna go in and remove them from the hot oil and place it on a napkin and again we just want to drain off that excess oil from our fritters all right So now that I'm finished removing my fritters, I'm just going to go in and drop the rest of the butter. So in a minute, I'm going to show you guys the final product of my banana coconut fritters. Stay tuned guys. And there you have it, the final product of my banana coconut fritters. I hope you guys enjoy this recipe. I hope you guys go ahead and try it out at home. Remember to tell your friends, tell your family members about Kali J's Kitchen and have them subscribe. Follow me on Facebook, Kali J's Kitchen, and follow me on Instagram, it's Kali Kitchen underscore one. Bye!